Hello, Purdue IE friends. Thanks to the hard work of all our IE members, we have had an exceptional semester and have lots of great news to report. First, faculty members are doing high-profile research and leadership work. Earlier in November, Stefan Biller co-led a national summit in Washington, D.C., focusing on resilient U.S. supply chains, attended by more than 250 stakeholders representing 29 states. In addition, Drs. David Johnson and Brandon Pitts received the NSF Career Awards, which makes 12 NSF Career Award winners among our current IE faculty. Dr. Hua Chai and her team developed an AI-based virtual teaching assistant that helps our students together with a human teaching assistant. Furthermore, our faculty received the MIT 35 Under 35 Award, Fulbright Scholar Award, the Outstanding Leadership in Globalization Award, Society's Fellow and Young Professional Awards, and many more. Faculty and staff growth is another priority of our school. We are proud to announce the addition of eight new faculty members who joined us this year, which makes a total of 43 faculty members with the 34 tenure, tenure track faculty members in our school. Furthermore, recruiting for multiple additional tenure track faculty positions is ongoing in areas aligned with the Purdue Computes Initiative, one of President Chiang's three priorities. By 2026, we anticipate having over 50 faculty members with over 42 tenured or tenure track faculty members in our school. On the student front, we currently have over 730 undergraduate students, 200 masters, and 110 PhD students enrolled in our programs. In this newsletter, you will find outstanding accomplishments and spotlights of many of our undergraduate and graduate students. To enrich the student learning experiences, several state-of-the-art technologies have been or will be added to the 17,000 square foot IE lab space in the new Dudley and Lambertus Hall. They are Move 4D for Digital Human Models and Ergonomics, Scanbox for Digital Twin-Based Product Quality Control, Vertical Lift Module and Autonomous Mobile Robots for Material Handling and Facility Logistics, and Augmented Reality and Virtual Reality Facilities and Internet of Things capabilities for human factors and data analytics. Finally, we are ever grateful to the many alums who inspire, support, and help guide the school and our students. This newsletter features four of our proud alums. They are Keith Kroc, a co-founder of the Kroc Institute for Tech Diplomacy and a former U.S. Under Secretary of State. Karen Gibson, the Sergeant at Arms of the U.S. Senate and a Lieutenant General of the U.S. Army. Theresa Carter, a member of Purdue University Board of Trustees and a Major General of the U.S. Air Force. And Chris Sardana, a Georgia Tech professor recently named DOE's Director of Advanced Materials and Manufacturing Technologies Office. Please enjoy reading our newsletter. I wish all of you a happy and healthy holiday season. Boiler up!